The government has reiterated its commitment to enhancing the quality of Kenyan tea with a prime focus on regaining the country's spot as the world's top tea producer. This follows the launch of the Lipton Tea Innovation and Technology Academy at State House Nairobi, where President William Ruto noted that the institution will offer cutting-edge training on tea growing to farmers. And as Grace Ahati reports, the president has stated that as part of Kenya's partnership with the Netherlands-based Lipton Tea and Infusions Company, Kenya will now be acknowledged as the producer of tea in its worldwide branding. To thank you, Your Excellency. In efforts to enhance the quality of Kenyan tea to ensure it meets the global standards, the government has established a partnership with Lipton Teas and Infusions Company based in Netherlands. President William Ruto today launched the Lipton Tea Innovation and Technology Academy at State House Nairobi, where he noted that the collaboration also seeks to promote sustainable and responsible practices in the tea sector, as well as develop the country as a role model in sustainable tea sourcing. The president has noted that as part of this partnership, Lipton Tea will acknowledge Kenya as the producer of the tea in its worldwide branding. We've always wanted to claim our space as the best tea growers globally. I think now working with Lipton's slowly we will begin to occupy that space and brand our country for what it is, a producer of the best tea in the world. Um, we've always wanted to make tea pay more to our farmers. We now have yet another opportunity to make sure that we produce tea in a way that the most earnings and incomes go to our farmers. Recognizing agriculture as a crucial pillar of the nation's economy, President Ruto highlighted that the academy will play a pivotal role in modernizing traditional tea farming methods that prioritize quality over quantity. The tea sector in particular holds immense potential in terms of local, regional and overseas opportunities and consequently boosting the tea value chain, especially through optimal blending and branding of Kenyan teas, is a specific commitment under our agenda. We have a major opportunity to enhance the economic contribution of the tea value chain as a key foreign exchange earner and a significant contributor to Kenya's global market presence by raising the value of our tea exports beyond the current 1.1 billion US dollars. President Ruto has at the same time noted that to actualize the full potential of tea, part of his government's agenda is to ensure farmers have the necessary knowledge to produce top tier tea globally. We must undertake training for our youth, especially those employed in the tea industry, in order to equip them with skills and knowledge on optimal tea husbandry practices and value added processing. Quality training involving deliberate investment in research and training resources is essential, while robust partnerships with organizations in the local and international space, public and private sector, are indispensable in facilitating the transfer of necessary knowledge and skills in the tea industry. This even as tea remains Kenya's top foreign exchange earner every year, with the tea industry contributing 4% to the country's gross domestic product GDP and accounting for 26% of its foreign exchange earnings. But more than that. Reporting for Hope TV Newswatch, I'm Grace Ahati.